Hello and welcome to Home Cooking Spain. Today I'm going to be cooking a sausage and mushroom stew. So let's begin. Okay, so let's turn this heat up. I'm going to turn it up to number eight and I'm going to add about three tablespoons of olive oil. This will be a quick recipe today. So I'll wait for that to heat up. Right, so once the oil is hot, or slightly hot, I'm going to add in all the sausages. And what I want to do, normally I, I cut these in halves or three bits because they're easier to turn around, you know. But today I thought I'm going to do them this way. So what I want is to just gently brown them on one side first. So we'll wait for that. Right, so let's turn these over. I'm going to turn it down a notch, down to number seven. This is starting to splash everywhere. So we'll turn them over so they, they brown off on the other side. And then we'll take them out and add the garlic and the mushrooms. So let's leave them there for about five minutes. Well, once the sausages are browned off on both sides, you can brown them off more if you like. You're the boss. I'm going to take them out all onto this plate because on, in that oil, I want to gently fry the mushrooms and garlic. Oh, this is splashy, isn't it? I have to give this a wipe in a minute. So let's add the mushrooms and the garlic. And we'll just gently fry this off for a few minutes. Well, it's been about five minutes and this is nicely browned up. So I'm going to add the sausages back in and whatever juice was there. And next, I'm going to add a stock cube. This is a meat one, but you can add any other that you like. I'll just break it in, because this one's very soft. It doesn't crumble like the others do. I'm always changing. And also, can't forget, a nice teaspoon of paprika. And a glass of wine. So I'll move this about. Remember, I've got this on number seven. The cooking process has stopped, but it will shortly begin again. So I'll just leave that there covered up for five minutes so that the alcohol evaporates. Okay, so then five minutes are up and the wine, no alcohol left in it, smelling delicious. So, my next step will be to give this a clean before doing anything else because this is a bloody nightmare. Sausages splash so much. So, let's give this a quick wipe. I don't want anyone telling me that my kitchen is dirty like someone did the other day after I while I was cooking some bacon.
which really pissed me off because I always try and keep my kitchen as clean as possible. So there you go, happy. Right, so um, the next step will be um, to add the potatoes in, I think. Um, yeah, let's add the potatoes in. And I just want to cover them up with some water. About 250 ml of water today. It all depends on the pot size that you have. So that should do it. So I'm going to turn this right up now because I want to bring it to the boil quickly and do a sauce check. Right, so this is starting to boil. So I'm just going to do a quick salt check. Wow, no salt needed. That cube has more than enough. Okay, so I'll turn this down now to number seven and I'll cover it up and I'll leave it there for half an hour. Well, exactly half an hour has gone by and this is done. Lunch is ready. So what I'm going to do now is turn the heat off, turn this annoying fan off, which is driving me crazy, though it's not quite no as noisy as other fans. And I'm going to move this out of the way a bit, put it to one side for five minutes and then I'll serve it up. Well, so here is the final result. Um, I hope that you enjoyed today's quick recipe video. Um, I look forward to sharing my next one with you. Thank you very much for watching and goodbye. Oh, cheers.